Got it. Yep. This one's nice and light. You know, when it comes to putting a liner in the bed of your truck, everybody knows you've got a couple of different options. Obviously, a lot of times we work with the spray-in liners, which are cool, but they're permanent and some people don't like that. Then you've got the drop-in liners. Those are cool too, but some people don't like those because they feel like it's going to scratch up the bed of their truck. Well, this is the bed rug, and it's like a removable soft option. I like it. It is nice. You know, it gives you the feel that you're in a luxury SUV. You know, it's nice and soft. You're going to kneel on it. It's not going to bang up your knees. You're going to be comfortable. It looks like it's carpet. But the thing is, it's not. It's made from 100% polypropylene, the same stuff they use in your battery box. So it won't mold, it won't mildew, and it'll resist most acids. And you know what? The thing is, it'll custom made for your truck, so you know it's going to fit. Each one has a separate part number, so the fit will be perfect each time. You know what, too? You get about three quarters of an inch of protection on this, right? So that's a lot of impact and dent resistance, if you think about it. I mean, you'd really have to throw something in there really hard and from a high location to dent it. So you get a lot of protection as well. You know, it's made from a closed cell foam is what they call it. Similar to like you'd have in a life vest, so it won't absorb water at all. So if you're hauling fine art, you know, fine china, whatever. Yeah. You're not gonna scratch it all up. Fragile. Love that. Like it when you speak Italian. <laughs> You know, installation of the bed rug is pretty easy as well. So when you've got it off to the side, they've already got all the Velcro in place and you just rip these little pieces of the other side of the Velcro and it's got the backing on it and you place those strategically. And then you put some on the bottom and we had some on the back, which we already got done. You want to make sure though, the most important thing is that the bed of the truck is good and clean because obviously you're using some tape here. So you want to make sure that it sticks really good. All right, you got this? I'm going to peel. Got it? I'm going to hold this yeah, yeah, hold that if you would. And it goes back. It goes back a little ways. There we are. Right. So you can oh. feel these padded ribs, man. That's nice. Yeah, they kind of fill into the grooves of the truck. And then that way, that was another thing too. That way, it's like a good, firm, flat surface across there. You know, you don't see the ribs in the truck now. It's nice. Screws in here for you. It's like a table. Put that down. Yeah. So then we just come along, do these along the same part. Another one over there. And it's in, and you don't have to worry about it flying out. I like the look of that. It looks great. Nice and clean. Comfy. Makes you want to roll around in it. I do. I just kind of, yeah, I was thinking the same thing. That's weird. 